Janky Gorilla here, and you're watching Apes on Movies. Today we're going to be talking about Annihilation. Uh, just released in February 2018, directed by Alex Garland and starring Natalie Portman, Oscar Isaac, and Jennifer Jason Leigh. Um, this is a sci-fi film, and uh, it's the second film from Alex Garland, the first being Ex Machina and 2015. Um, it does have some very dark themes to it, and it's uh, one of the more beautiful movies I've seen. So let's get into the actual review with no spoilers. Ryan <laughs> so the premise of the movie is a group of scientists venture into this aura that is um, slowly growing and they call it the shimmer and within this they're seeking answers um, the main thing they're looking for is how to stop it how to remove it um, previous to these scientists going in there were others that went in and never returned so it's clearly dangerous the shimmer is actually what they're calling the area in which the scientists go into <laughs> it's that gorgeous kind of murky prismatic looking wall that they uh that they walk through and the shimmer is the area inside uh, there are some strange things happening the um the amount of growth that's happening in there the, that's odd um, you can see that there are creatures that don't look normal there are plant life that, that are growing abnormally and they look strange but they are vibrant and they are thriving the shimmer is growing um, but this definitely could get out of hand if it reached lar some larger cities um, where a lot of people live it's nice to see uh, Natalie Portman wielding a gun in a movie I know she has in a, a couple of movies prior um, but to this degree is, is different and uh, this character is definitely different for her um, so it's nice to see her range and of course she still cries Natalie Portman always cries and because she's the best at it uh, I don't know if anybody can cry as good as Natalie Portman I mean there's probably a few out there <laughs> it's like Tom Cruise in running that's Tom Cruise Let's move on. Yeah, it's a great movie. It's a great sci-fi film. Well directed, uh, beautiful again. Do I have any complaints? Yes, I have complaints. I felt like that the, the, the pace at the beginning was, was a bit too slow. And there were a lot of things that were given to us, a lot of pieces of the puzzle that we didn't know where they went. I held on. I wanted to see where this was going. Once it, the pace picked up, once the answers started to come, or at least I could see there was a path going in that direction, I, I, I was hooked and I stayed. But there were some moments at the beginning where I, I, I lost a little bit of interest. What's wrong with me? I gained it right back a little bit into the movie. So if you, if you don't like that slow pace, either A, uh, you know that going into this, so you should be adjusted for it. So get through those first, you know, that first 15 or 20 minutes of the movie and just accept that that's going to be some setup and you might be confused. That's okay. I was a little bit confused, but then it's like, yeah, I'm okay. Or B, just don't watch the movie because you may you, you may not enjoy it. This isn't, a, this isn't your typical popcorn blockbuster, so don't think that. It's not. This is not that movie. So get out there, watch Annihilation, tune back in with me in a week or so, um, I'll have I'll have my take on the movie with spoilers, plenty of spoilers. I knew this was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs>